Hi guys! Well, today I'm going to talk a little bit about my Nikonos 5. It took in water some 10, 15 years ago. I don't even remember. Maybe 10 years ago. And uh, I left it. Now I decided to fix it. Actually, the rubber here started to get soft, but that you, you just put on uh, baby powder o over and over. Now it's time to put it again and that will cure again. So that's no problem. Now, where was the problem? One O-ring had been leaking. So, obviously, those that you regularly use were in good shape, the lens also. So I had to start looking for what it could have been. To make a long story short, it was this one. And it's a rather simple one to fix. Just take off the screw there, pull it out, and it was full of salt, all dry, so I greased it up. It should be good to go. But when I was at it, I checked all the O-rings. And I also took everything out to make sure there was no damage on the inside. First thing you have to take off is this little piece here with four screws. And then uh, there's one screw there, two screws in the bottom there. But before you can lift this piece out, you have to take away this and this. There's one screw on the top, and then you just lift it up. There are three O-rings inside. This one has this little thing here that holds it. So once that is off, you, you just pull this off and then lift this one straight up. There are two O-rings in here. The last O-ring you don't actually need to take off in order to lift out this thing inside. But to lift this out, Completely, you have to unscrew the flat cable to the display. And that's a little bit tricky to get back in. So my trick to get it back in was to put this one underneath it to hold, help hold everything in place while I put in the screws. So the last O-ring is the one inside here. I have to pull this rub down a bit unscrew this screw which you probably won't be able to do i couldn't do it it broke off because it's a little screw that screwed i don't know somewhere here i have it yeah it's a little screw like that stainless steel screw that screwed into the frame of the camera and that causes galvanic cor corrosion so there was no way to get it out i broke it off to be able to pull this piece off. Well, it's a loose piece here with a piece of plastic that controls an arm and inside there is a screw. I don't want to break it off now. Ah, yes, there it came. So this is just a loose piece. Oh, I did break it off. Shoot. That piece there. Uh, well, so here is a screw and you pull this arm out and then the the other piece goes inside, and then you can fix that O-ring too. And before you can do that, though, you have to lift out this thing inside. And that's it. And you can grease up all your O-rings and put it back together. It worked after I did Of course, there are O-rings here and here too. The, the flash connector and the battery. So... Um, it didn't work immediately after doing that because after so many years without using the different connectors, copper to copper, they had oxidized. But after five, ten times using it, it started working. So now it's working again. This one I'll just glue back in place because I'm not going to worry about drilling out that screw.